we're in our campaign, we're going to come down over here and we're going to go to ads and extensions. And this is where we're going to create, sorry, we're going to, up here you're going to toggle over to extensions. And this is where we're going to create our ad extensions. And that includes site links. So we come here, pulls up a list. These are all the ad extensions. And I actually have a video that I made earlier um, going through each one of these and how they work and what they're used for. So check that out. I'll drop a link for that in the description below this video. But for now, site link, we're going to come in here. You can either add it at the account campaign or ad group level. So you can have different site links for each ad group, which is powerful. But for right now, this example, we're just going to do campaign level. So this is going to show for all of our ad groups in our XYZ Roofers campaign. And here's your headline. We'll do your text. So we'd say like certified roofing experts. And then you could do a description here or here, whatever. It doesn't really matter. Then you would come down here, drop your URL for the site link of where you want it to go. Let's say uh, let's say it would go to a maybe an about page or something like that. Advanced options. One thing real quick, let me backtrack here. So when you're setting up your site links, if you get confused about what is what, you can always hover over this little question mark here, and it's going to come up and just basically tell you what this is, what it's used for. And it's really helpful if you're new and don't really understand the AdWords interface. So just keep that in mind when you're setting all this up. You come down here if you did advanced options. So you can do device preference here. You can do this mobile or desktop. We usually do a set of site links. For desktop and a set for mobile and let Google decide which to show or you could just do one set and make them all mobile and Google will show them on mobile and probably show them on desktop as well we'll decide like that also but just for for us it's just the way we've always done it we like doing it that way and we've had success with it so that's how we do it so for this one this would be if we're doing it our way it would be just the first desktop so we come down here you can do an ad schedule if you want to show the site links between certain times start date end date whatever we don't really mess around with this too much I don't think you should either just let it run so we have our first site link